I auditioned through my manager at this point in time. I did not have an agent. Um, yeah. And I sent in a self tape and I think it was for the role of Terry. Um, and initially they were requesting only male actors because originally my character, Margot, was actually a Miles because these are real people. Oh, Miles, I was, a, I was a man in real life. So they were casting for men. Somehow I still got the audition and I was like, sick. So uh, I auditioned, I didn't hear anything for maybe two months. And you know, at that point you're like, well, shucks, you didn't get it. Um, and this one kind of stung because I really liked the part and I, I really liked the little gritty evilness that I, my character would have. And um, so this one kind of stung and eventually I got a callback for what I thought was um, for my, roast, my most recent audition. Uh, so I went into the audition, completely wrong script, uh, completely wrong film. And uh, when they started, I was in the room with the casting directors first before I went into right. the room with David. And so they were like, okay, we'll just like run through it with you. So, you know, brush you up a little bit. And I was like, okay, so we start in the first line. And he goes, it's your line. I said, no, it's not. It's yours. And he said, no, it's not it's yours. And I said, no, it's not, it's yours. And so we wow. looked at the script and we realized we did not have the same thing. He said, you know what? We're just going to wing it. So put me in the room with David and thank the Lord. He was on my side. David just goes, Oh, I'm not going to have you do any of that. We're just going to talk. So we just talked about the film and it was a really, really easy, fun process. That's when I actually figured out what I was auditioning for. Before that, I did not know that this was a Halloween film. So yeah. Um, yeah, by the end of the phone call, I knew I had the part. And then I got a call five minutes later that they were negotiating. So it was um, it was so quick, moving it's like happened. lightning speed. Yeah. Yeah. And were you a fan of the, the franchise before all this and had been had you been keeping up to date with everything? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Um, again, like I said, you know, right when we started this phone call, I'm a holiday freak. So yeah. I start decorating first of September for Halloween. And I watch this whole list of movies every single year, all the horror movies, all like the fun, quirky things that I watched as a kid, you know, like the little vampire. I watch all that stuff every single year. And so that I can really get, <laughs> I get the most, out, the of most. The, out of the two months that I have. Um, and Halloween and Jamie Lee Curtis has always been on those lists. So um, I've grown up watching it and being a fan of the films. And um, so I think it was uh, very healing to my inner child 